This is the story of Minetta, a 15-year-old black slave who thought she would become more than a mistress. Minetta survived the terrors of the slave ship. These terrors included hunger strikes, many naked human beings, the bruised and festering flesh, the fetid air and the accumulation of dirt. She was examined by Master Raymond when he looked at her defects and tasted her perspiration to see if her blood was pure. Once Master Raymond was satisfied, he chose her as his slave to work in his plantation. Poison was my method. It was easy enough to put a few drops in Master's brandy and watch as he sipped it with satisfaction. Never would I have imagined doing such an inhumane deed until he told me two weeks ago that my services are no longer needed. You served your time well, Manetta. You've been a good woman. But a man needs more than just one alternative when it comes to his choice of whom to bend and desire. After all, I am a man with many options. That's all he said, and then continued to zip his trousers up and leave the room. He told me I was beautiful and much smarter than all the others. I'll never forget the day that Master summoned me to his chambers in the middle of the night. I knew for a long time that all those stolen kisses and promises that we would be together forever. This led to him finally making a real woman out of me. I have loved Master Raymond ever since. I was his lady after all. The one whom he would leave Madam for and the one who could bear his children. He told me that I was everything he wanted in a wife and that Madam could not do the things a wife should do. She could not please him the way I did and that made me feel very special. He said that he liked me. That was enough to drive me crazy and assured me that he would leave Madam. Suddenly, Master no longer summoned me into his chambers and treated me like I was nothing but a slave. I was treated like all the other women slaves, accused of insolence, shamming sickness and disobedience. Once she refused to finish her work, she was in solitary confinement for 60 hours. All I ever was was a secret of the mere darkness that existed among the inhumane acts which I had been part of, a mistress in disguise. I had to eliminate anyone in my path. Thank you.